Hi, this is Rajshakar Reddy. In this video tutorial, I am going to explain control statements in C language. First of all, what is control statements? Control statements will control the flow of execution. Why we need to use control statements in C language? Because when we use control statements, then it will skip some code based on the condition we specified in the program. Without using control statements, we cannot write a C program. We can write a C program without control statements, but the program will execute in sequentially. If we not want the program to execute sequentially, then we need to go for control statements. So that today our topic is control statements. Control statements will control the flow of execution control statements control statements enable us to specify the flow of, flow of program control that is the order in which the instructions in a program must be executed they make it possible to make decisions to perform tasks repeatedly or to jump from one section of code to another Control statements is nothing but decision making statements only. Decision making statement is depending on the condition block need to be executed or not which is decided by condition. If the condition is If the condition is true, statement block will be executed. If condition is false, then statement block will not be executed. In this section, we are discuss about if, then or if nothing but if only if then else if else we can also call it as if else on the switch statement in C language there are three types of decision making statements if first one second one if fails, third one, switch. If then statement. If then is most common basic statement of decision making statement. It tells to program to execute a certain part of code only if particular condition is true. See the syntax. If condition flower presses open, flower presses end. In in the block, number of statements will be there. See for example, we know that as includes studio dot h. Std io dot h means it is a header file. It will show the standard input and output. Now main wide main main means the program. The execution of the program start from main method. Mm, open the flower process and then int int is a data type followed by variable name. And we call variable is also called as identifier. And we insulate it with the 10. The value constant value. 10 value is assigned to time. CLR SCR means it will screen the it will clean the screen. If condition if time less than 10, print of good morning. False, print of good, good afternoon. If 10 means 10 less than or equal to 12, no? Then it will print the good morning because 10 less than 12. Get CH is a predefined method. Constructing the body if statement is always optional. Create the body when we are having multiple statements. For example, statement is not required to specify the body. If the body is not specified, then automatically condition part will be 
terminated with next semicolon we are not using any floor braces now then it will terminate after the first semicolon of the if statement if statement okay now we will see the flow chart of if then statement we know the syntax of the if followed by condition followed by parenthesis inside the if block there are number of statements first condition if the condition is true then it will enter into the if block the statements will execute if the condition is false then it will come out of the condition constructing the body or you know all those things now else if else else it is a keyword we know that if also is a keyword if and else are keywords in keywords means that has a predefined meaning in c language we can create a alternate block of if part using else is op always optional that is it is recommended to use when we are having alternate block of condition in any program among if and else only one block will be executed when if condition is false then else part will be executed if part is executed then automatically else part will be ignored if else statement in general it can be used to execute one block of statement among two blocks in c language if and else are the keywords in c you know that if and else are keywords now see the syntax of if else if followed by condition flower which is open then a group of statements and end of the if block now else flower which is open number of group of statements end of the parenthesis in the above syntax when you are whenever condition is true all the if block statements are executed remaining statement of the program by neglecting else block statement if the condition is false else block statement remaining statement of the program are executed by neglecting if block statements example see same example example void main we know that the execution sta starts from main method flower brush is open int time equal to 10 int means data type time equal to variable name time means variable name 10 is constant we are assigning 10 value to time clr as an standard to clear the screen if time less than 12 print f good morning else print f good afternoon 10 less than 12 true condition true means only if statements will execute now the output will be flow chart of if else statement if followed by condition and if block block of statements will be there end of the if block else flow brush is open statements end of the flow block if the condition is true then it will enter into the if block if the condition is false then it will end directly and come out of the loop and it will execute the else okay thank you thank you for watching my videos if you like my video please subscribe and like my video thank you